The first angry swimmers at Hampstead Ponds are threatening the City of London Corporation with legal action. They say an increase in charges to use the ponds is unfair and discriminates against disabled swimmers. The corporation says it has to charge because voluntary contributions weren't enough to pay for the upkeep of the ponds. Katie Barnfield explains. They've been a this in central London. Now the Hampstead Heath Ponds are the site of a bitter row between swimmers and the City of London Corporation. A group from the Ladies Pond are now threatening to take them to court over charges they say are discriminatory and unfair. When I lost my sight five years ago, I started swimming through the winter and it's total sanctuary. It's the only place I feel safe, I can actually swim, I can't see, but I can actually enjoy the water. If that was taken as soon as it brought in, disabled people on low income just can't look at help. Swimming at Hampstead Ponds used to be free, but payment is now compulsory, costing over £4 for an adult swim and just under £2.50 for a concession ticket. But it's season tickets where swimmers say the latest increase is most unfair. For concessions, it's just gone up to nearly £76 a year, an increase of over 20%. They only allow you to buy the season ticket up front from a single purchase. The sorts of money they're talking about seem little to them, but they're huge to people on low income. They simply don't understand. Protest charges have gone on for months, but after the latest increase, these ponders said have brought in some who claim the price hike breaches the Equality Act. People who provide services or public bodies um, can't discriminate in relation to um, their services. So um, the fact that the City of London has introduced new charges, which disproportionately affect disabled people, um, is in contravention um, of the Equality Act. The City of London Corporation told us they deny any suggestion that bringing in charging for the ponds is discriminatory or unlawful. They say the prices are fair and are used to keep the ponds safe and accessible for as many people as possible. The Ladies Pond Association are now planning a judicial review to try and force them. Katie Barnfield, ITV News.